Welcome, one and all, to The Late Show. I'm your host, Stephen Colbert, and I... <laughs> I want to start off tonight by wishing a happy Hanukkah to my Jewish viewers. Yeah, Jacob Hirsch. But only them, okay? <laughs> it's an honor system. If you're not Jewish, no Hanukkah wishes for you. Let them have this. <laughs> Right now, this is a solemn week in America because of the passing of President George H.W. Bush, the last president from the greatest generation. <laughs> Bush served uh, in World War II as a torpedo bomber pilot in the Pacific Theater, flew 58 missions. Um, when his plane got hit by Japanese anti-aircraft guns, he had to bail out, and this is actual footage of a young George H.W. Bush being rescued by the crew of a submarine. The closest our current president has gotten to a submarine is a $5 footlong. <laughs> of course... Uh, of course, almost 50 years later, Bush did get back at Japan when he threw up in the lap of the Japanese <laughs> prime minister. Yeah. <laughs> dramatic moment, dramatic moment. You know what they say, revenge is a dish best served. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> he was a Republican, but he wasn't a bitter partisan. He worked with Bill Clinton famously on humanitarian relief many times. And I'm happy to say that when we took our old show to entertain troops in Iraq in 2009, he was kind enough to do this video for us. This is President George Bush, number 41, and I want to thank our brave troops for their courageous service to our country. Back in World War II, the USO used to send us great big stars like Marlene Dietrich, Lauren Bacall, and the Rockettes. I'm just saying, this Stephen Colbert guy better have great legs. Back in 2009, I did. <laughs> the 41st president was known for the kindness and respect he showed to even his political rivals. Like this note, he left in the Oval Office for his successor, Bill Clinton, who defeated him in the 1992 election. You will be our president when you read this note. I wish you well. I wish your family well. Your success now is our country's success. I am rooting hard for you. We may never see. We may never see the likes of that again. That's the spirit you want. Yeah. That's the spirit you want for the country. The next Oval Office note is going to read, Dear lying loser, I wish you no luck. I rubbed my butt on this desk. P.S. Be sure to feed Stephen Miller three crickets a day and always lock his cage. <laughs> Meanwhile... H.W. <laughs> Bush. H. W. Bush. A, a beloved, only one term, yet beloved. President Trump, keep that in mind. 